Hello, we are back with the Formula V at uh, Summit Point this time, but uh, we're back on the Jefferson circuit, but check this out, the reverse course. <laughs> That's interesting, isn't it? Um, man, I love the Formula V for this. Um, you get to do all these interesting circuits. I'm going to go ahead and run over that cone, and uh, the reason why is because it should give me a black flag here any second for entering uh, pit road unsafely. I actually uh, start and stopped a second ago to uh, make sure that was the case. But uh, where is it? Where's my black flag? Because I don't want to put a time in. Oh well. We'll, uh, we'll just stop short. But uh, the reason I don't want to do a lap is because I gotta get used to these Formula V's again because they are just crazy to drive. <laughs> so easy to spin out and uh, it's been a minute since I last did one and I don't want to spin out in front of the field but also because we don't have home field advantage this time. We are on a foreign server. It looks like an Australian server or something maybe because uh, the majority of the people in here are not from the United States. So you'll see we've got like uh, pretty bad ping and stuff. So uh, that means anytime we're gonna get close to someone, it's not gonna be too good. Can we get the black flag this time? I don't wanna get it off track by going in the grass because that'll count against my safety rating but I don't want the lap to count either. I don't know if there's a better way to do this but I want to do some laps, keep it interesting, and also get a little more practice in, but I also don't want to put a lap time in. Because, uh, well, the more practice, the merrier here, because I was just kind of getting the hang of that Jefferson circuit, and now we're going in reverse. <laughs> Throwing a curveball at us. So that's fine. Oh, yep, see? So easy to do cold tires. Not so much for not messing up my uh, safety rating. At least this lap definitely won't count if I even have any laps left. I think this is counting as my quote-unquote final lap, but uh, hey, there's one way to un invalidate it. Um, so we'll ride it out for the rest of practice and maybe get in the hang, get the hang of, uh, you know, not spinning out. And the thing is too, like I'm spinning out still running the preferred line and uh, when you're racing by someone you're probably not always running the preferred line so you gotta be able to hold on to the car in uh, not ideal circumstances so I'm gonna take it easy hopefully be one of those races where uh, I could pick up some spots just by uh, passing the guys that spin out so um, we're uh, ranked number three here I assume this is top split Maybe? I don't know. Almost spun it out again here. This, that one's a fine line because this car does not like turning <laughs> while under any sort of speed. So it's real easy to get it spun, especially when you're still warming up the tires. So uh, My best lap is about a 56.3. This one's probably going to be about a 56, what, I don't know, 4.5? It's not gonna count. Um, last 56.43. And that would have put us about fourth. So we've got top five, five speed, potentially. But uh, that's not gonna matter too much if we can't bring it home safely. So the first couple laps, we'll be very careful. If you've uh, seen me drive this car before, you know what that looks like. Yeah, it's a real fine line around that corner. Um, hopefully dodge some guys that are spinning. And bring ourselves to a good finish. Here on Reverse Jefferson. So interesting that it's even an option. I wonder, um, I mean, obviously they must run this in real life with something. But uh, do they run Formula Vs here? I have no idea. I don't know anything about it. It's, uh, I don't know, it's pretty fun when you get the hang of it. I always like driving the Formula V. It's a bit of a 
a challenge to control while, uh, you know, still just being kind of a, you know, you get these tiny little courses. Came in there way too hard, man. All right, well, I gotta stop doing that. This is probably, uh, what's the word? Foreshadowing <laughs> the race. I'm probably gonna spin out in that corner. Oh, God. Hope not. Or maybe I can get it out of the way now. So I've, I've given myself essentially an off track by getting 4x during qualifying, <laughs> which is a 1x, so. Not helping myself out there, but I've got a pretty good safety rating on uh, road right now anyway. It's not like it's a concern or anything. It's like 4.53 right now or something. So Plus, uh, hey, if I keep the race clean, it'll still be a gain for me if I can zero exit in the race. Which is the goal anyway, right? That corner is also a bit of a fine line. You can go a lot faster through there if you push it, but uh, it's dangerous. Man, that's probably my sorest spot though. Because like, like, my choices right now either are uh, go through there slow or try to go through there fast and spin it. <laughs> that's kind of where I'm at right now. Can't quite seem to find the middle ground. Obviously, once uh, you get a few laps in, you can start being a little more daring with the car. So maybe that's all I got to do is just make sure that uh, at the start, I'm not trying to do anything crazy. And then I can try to go a little faster. Uh, all right, so just about everybody qualified. So we'll be nice and safe here, hopefully, in the back. We'll see about that. Um... Got some more of my controls configured. I got my tear-offs, which uh, your visor can get a little bit dirty here in Formula V, so that'll be nice to have. I think I might just let this guy go on my back left here. Um, we'll see how hard he's smashing the gas pedal to go here to have the start. But uh, I could see some guys looping it just right off the start. Um, on this first corner. I can easily see that happening. Alright, here we go. Ooh, they're trying to spin. Guy on my tail. Guys, taking it really soft. Oh, thank goodness the guy behind us also saw it coming because they were taking it way too easy and I had to lay off real hard. I can't believe we didn't die there, to be honest. It bunched up so bad. gonna go wide here intentionally let him by I want some breathing room for these first couple laps Whew. all right so we survived lap one that's not gonna be the end of wrecking guys we'll just try to keep up with this pack keep an eye on them and what they're doing see if they wreck each other racing side by side and uh, get that draft too. Another guy trying to wreck. Oh man. Uh, I don't know if we actually made contact, but uh, iRacing said we did. I slammed on the brakes, and I don't think we got damage from it, thankfully. But uh, still gave us the safety <laughs> rating hit because I think uh, it prediction coded that I was going to hit it because it was so close. So, I think we're good. I don't think we have damage, but uh, it's not going to be a good safety rating race, I don't think. Plus, we lost time because I had to slam on the brakes, but not too bad. 
try to keep in touch here. I know we're faster than a handful of guys up here, but uh, we just got some distance to make up now. But uh, we're clear behind us for a minute, so that's good. There we go, pushed that one pretty well. Uh, here comes corner of death. Take it kind of easier. Okay. Take myself out of it. Get the curve a bit. Oh man, that ruined our corner. We're not doing well. I'm out of practice. These formula V's. Plus, I've never been in this configuration before. Not this way around, anyway. <laughs> Take a breath. Try to get some consistent laps in. Instead of doing whatever on earth I'm doing right now. I wonder if our uh, connection helped not hit that guy that spun. I wonder if we were supposed to but didn't. A little better. Trying to hit my marks. Uh, we'll keep an eye on the distance in front. We're obviously pulling away from the guys behind us, so that's not too much of a concern. That last lap was at 56.5. I think it said, what, 2.4, 2.6 or something at the line? Oh, think about that. They're getting draft ahead of us, though, I think, more than we are from them. Still afraid to push it too hard. But there we can actually kind of go a little bit now. Try to get a good run out of the corner there because we got this nice straightaway ahead of us. Um, don't think we're gaining too much. Well, that guy's in front, unfortunately. I think that was about where we were before. You've just done a 56.5. Sector 2 is 0.3 off the pace. Huh. Interesting. So maybe if I do want to catch up to him, i got to start pushing a little harder. As much as uh, it's not what I want to do. if I push harder maybe I'm just gonna do worse all right we get up some time uh, that way that time around I don't know if I was necessarily faster if uh, we just uh, were a little better than the guy ahead but Take it. Okay, Carlton, Another one of those cars, it's good to let it roll. Seems to get some good turning done when you do that. Okay, push that one a little harder. Push that pretty hard. That's not gonna work on cold tires, so thankfully the tires are warm enough now. If I try to do that with the at the start of the race, I'm doing a 360, probably a full 720. I'll be spinning so hard. But they're just kind of even with them. Uh, these guys are they're top split guys, so they're fast. Car is getting a little lighter, it feels like. Fuel's burning off. Can toss it around a little bit better. 
and uh, these are pretty short races just got the five minutes left warning EF spins that's an impressive save he's just gonna block the entry of the lane Okay, guy entering on the track. Kind of lost an opportunity to get by him there, but uh, not sure. I'm faster than he is anyway. He just made a mistake. So, I didn't want to enter that corner side by side. But uh, I wanted to try to avoid lifting more than I wanted to. It was a little wide. We gained that spot because of the wrecking, wreck, the wrecking guy. So now we're up to I don't know where we were sixth. <laughs> kind of got to focus on this guy ahead of me. He's having a lot of trouble in that corner. Uh, man, went through, through side by side. You did not back out. Decided to fight for it. Alright, we survived though. I gave him room I needed to. So, we got a fight on our hands. Entered a little wider there, hoping to get a uh, better runoff. Pretty equal though. Make sure we're shifting at a good time. Uh, here's the corner he's not good at. I can't push it if he's right in front of me. Can't drive through him. Car got really light there. That was not a welcome feeling. Trying some things. Nothing's working quite enough. Overdrove it a bit, unfortunately. Gotta just focus on taking my normal line, I think. And uh, not worrying too much about what he's up to. Look at all that speed we have on when through that corner. Clear. Slide job. <laughs> oh, but we overdrew it. But I'm protecting the side I want to protect, so. <sighs> Alright. Can we pull away? With this draft, not likely, but we're gonna try. He is right there. Oh boy. Hopefully, we can get uh, to this little part before he does. Yeah, because we gained time on him through there. Oh man, the car is so light. I almost pushed it too hard. I felt it skittering. <laughs> Hope he doesn't make any crazy dives for this last lap. Push it. Oh, he's right there. I think he took that better than I did. We're pretty equally matched, I think. Don't you take it too wide through here. I know you're not good. Through this corner. Oh, we're wide. Oh boy, lost the momentum. I think we 
got it though. Just gotta get, not mess up this final big corner. Spine left. Uh oh. We got another free spot. I'm gonna let him try to stick it by through a uh, draft, but he's not gonna make it. Woo! Great race, man. I was sweating. <laughs> Ooh, he's fun. <laughs> he's fun. I don't know if he did it on purpose, just be goofy, but yeah, it was a great race. Man, that was intense. We kept it clean, though. It was good stuff. <laughs> that was real fun. Love these things. And I ended up in uh, fourth because of that last, uh, I think it was, what, the one? They must have wrecked. 6x, not my finest performance there. Actually, uh, was the worst on the field, yikes. But uh, it was because of that Phantom 4X that really set us apart, unfortunately. But, all right. Two, two, four, and ten. Hey, we're the top finishing United States uh, club. <laughs> what's, what, what's the way I'm trying to say this? Um, not citizen, because technically they could be a citizen, even if they're from... So, what is it? The top finishing um, liver of in the United States. I don't know. I'm going to stop talking before I embarrass myself more, and let's watch some incidents. <laughs> uh, chopper cam. Get rid of that garbage. So, off the start. We're watching the uh, guy who started in last. He's not doing much. We got off track. Just pushed it a little too hard in that corner. It's a little tough because you're going at into you're entering that corner at a different speed than you're used to, so you don't really get to practice how hard to take the first corner unless you like stop during practice at the start finish line. <laughs> you know, so that's a bit tough to judge. Sometimes oh no, is it broken? No, it ain't broken. Well, we uh we now join this program in prog progress. Excuse me. I think we're gonna want to do far chase because we're getting too many trees in the way. Yeah, lap one, cold tire, he just enter, enters a little too hard, I think. Or maybe he had to slow down for the guy in front of me who took it softer. Or in front of him, rather. It's wanting to show us the car that wrecked <laughs> for a few extra seconds. More than we need. Uh, this is battle for third. Looked like they did alright, I don't see any contact there. He entered a lot harder there. I think because those guys in front of him were uh, side by side. No contact though. That's a hard entry, but he makes it work. Man, these incidents aren't working right. Oh, tree. And suddenly a car. This is still lap two, by the way. <laughs> Even with all we've seen already. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. lots of guys getting loose and d trying people trying to dodge. Oh yeah, this is where we hit them. Okay, so it looks like we did actually make contact, but I slowed it down enough that it didn't damage the the car. It looks like so that was a chain reaction of guys checking up and everything. I slam on the brakes and just barely touch them. If I go into a full speed, our car's broken and then we're just done. And there's no way we're recovering for fourth. So, oof. Yeah, live time, it didn't feel like I hit him, but I just soft tapped him because I, <laughs> I went so slow. See, um, I thought maybe he'd start slamming the brakes right about there. So I didn't want to just like keep left or something. But uh, he kind of keeps in it or something. Or like just stays off the gas until he ends up over there. And by then, there's no way I'm dodging it. So my only course of action is to 100% the brakes. And thankfully, by doing so, I kept the damage to a minimum. So, that's how we survived that. And then we'll take a look at uh, the spinner for a couple extra seconds. And take a look at the guy in third. Why? I don't know. But we're taking a look at him. 
This is the guy who had started in uh, last place. Seeing him for no reason. I think we're going to have to just skip through some of these because it looks like we're getting, uh, we're looking at them for no reason. in here. John Flood. We had uh, Michael Greed or something like that too. Cool names. Not very cool incident report though because we're getting a bunch of junkus. Seen a lot of stuff for no reason so I'm gonna just keep uh, speeding through until we see something potentially interesting. Uh, it's broken. That stinks. Well, while I'm doing this, I guess I will say that I had a. Uh, I'm happy with the race. Wish it. Uh, the incidents were a little bit lower, but uh, can't feel too bad because the uh, the car itself was pretty clean. Subtract that 4x, and we just had a 2x from uh, going off the track a couple of times, and we piloted ourselves towards a P2. Which is right about where I was supposed to be as a as the three car, I guess. So, and we did a little bit of close racing, and uh, thankfully the the ping, the lag didn't uh, hurt us. So, all good news. But uh, I guess that's it. I guess uh, no more incidents to to see. I guess we could watch uh, my pass pass to the guy at the end there to get that final spot. Not the guy that wrecked, but you know, the the guy we uh, said good race to at the end. Because this is not working. Okay, so stop hurting my eyes doing that. And let's, uh, so here we are. Let's do this like chase. So, I wasn't hitting my marks the greatest. Um, kind of a couple of times trying to do something a little different, see if I could get a run on them or something. It's probably not the way I should have been doing it, because <laughs> uh, I guess it would make sense to just drive the way that uh, is fastest. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, this one? Okay, so we got the nose on there, and I had to enter the infamous corner that I spun out a couple of times in qualifying for. So that was almost like redemption for me. <laughs> Spin there a couple times in qualifying, and then uh, the moment of truth. I get side by side the guy and have to enter, enter shallow. And the moment of truth here is, do I spin it trying to make this pass? And uh, I was able to stick it. Thankfully, I had the tires warm, and he kind of tried to do a little crossover, but didn't quite have it. But uh, I made the pass. I got it through there, and uh, he was kind to me. He enters hard there, but uh, doesn't plow into the back of me or something. So, uh, and we got past him, and then we held him off this final lap, too. Even though he had the draft, he was catching up. I thought he might try to go side by side through there, but uh, thankfully he didn't, because he looked like he was having trouble in that corner more than uh, any other one. Ooh. He was better through that corner. That corner I'm not too good at, but uh, we did everything we needed to to stay up there. So, it was a good one. Got a P4. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed Jefferson in reverse. Uh, I did. It was, uh, it was a good fun. See ya.